Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Gardening with Creations by DX and Co. Today I'm actually going to show you how I'm going to plant a pineapple from a store-bought pineapple. So there's a lot of controversy around how you get started with pineapples. A lot of people say you need to take the top of this pineapple here and put it in water for it to grow roots. Some people um, plant it directly in soil. I'm going to show you how I do it today and show you the differences to why I'm doing it this way. So let's get started. So for starters, you can take a knife and cut this right here. And, uh, but then you'll have to cut it a little bit further back and expose it a little bit more. So the easiest method is actually grab one hand on top, one hand here, and actually just twist and you'll get this right off of there. So uh, and then from there, what you want to do is this is where you can see right here on the top is where people think you need to expose the roots. So they put it in water and so, so this will start growing roots. And in fact, actually, this pineapple, you can actually start to peel back these particular leaves about three or four layers up, which I've already started to do here. And you can see that the, it's already got roots forming. They're bunched up, which is okay. You do not need to try to loosen them up or anything like that. They will loosen themselves. They look dried out, but that's okay. They will come to life. Um, so you don't have to worry about that. So this is not a foolproof method of, of growing pineapples, but it does work. And if you do follow this method and you plant it in uh, a loose, well-draining soil, not a sandy soil, but a very loose, well-draining soil, in about two years, your plant will start to form and actually uh, start growing pineapples. It'll grow over those years. It'll get bigger and bigger. And then after about the second year, it'll grow and, and form pineapples. So... Uh, there you have it guys. I've gone ahead and got a lot of this exposed. So I'm going to now take my pot of soil, which I've already got ready here for us. Let me change our angle here. So I've got my head of pineapple. I've got my soil of dirt pre-moistened actually um, and it's ready to go. Now this is an extra large bucket for this. I won't need to remove it from this bucket. Most people started out in just a small like four inch pot which is perfectly fine. I'm going to start it out in my larger pot so I never have to replant it again. Um, but you're just going to take this pineapple here and you're going to dig yourself out just a small hole. You only want to get this part in there. Pineapples are very prone to root rot if they're buried too deep. So you don't want to go in there very high. Just want to put it in there just enough to to bury those new roots that you peeled back and pack it in just slightly around it and then you can water. Now when watering a pineapple a lot of people think you need to water the soil around it. In fact what you do with a pineapple from my research is you just water dead center in the pineapple unlike most um, fruits and vegetables you water the roots not the foliage. With this if you water straight down into the foliage with this and just kind of fill up the water, let it fill all the way up and then it'll sink back down, fill it up maybe a second to a third time, it'll sink down event, um, in there and just do that about once a week, once to twice a week is all pineapples need to be watered. You'll start to see this back, this foliage here die off, but as long as the foliage in the middle remains green, you'll start to eventually see some new growth forming. So again, um, pineapples like uh, about eight hours of sun if they're going to fruit. If you want this just to be a nice greenery plant and you grow it with about two to three hours of sun, it'll just stay green, it'll never fruit. But if you keep it in about eight hours worth of sun, you'll start to see fruit within about two years. So this is a, a very long process to start to grow pineapple fruit. Um, but it is well worth it to have a delicious pineapple that you grew on your own from something you bought from the store. So that's all there is to it guys. I've got my plant planted. You saw it wasn't difficult. Um, it's in there nice and tight and I didn't even try because it's already a stiff plant to begin with. So I'm going to go ahead and give it some water and that's all there is to it. So there you have it guys. I appreciate you taking the time to watch it. That's how you can grow your own store-bought um, pineapple 
in your own house and um, I'll probably put it out in the greenhouse over the summer to, for that high humidity is uh, traditionally from Hawaii. So I do want that high heat, high humidity, but in the winter I'll bring it in, I'll keep it in the house. So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys give it a try yourself. Let me know how your pineapple is growing. And as always guys, I hope you're staying safe and enjoying your gardens.